Oh, I wasn't sad. I just needed a... <laughs> That's right guys, today I'll be opening my second favorite holiday set, Haldane Fates. I'm going to get everything unboxed and we'll get started. I'm sure you've all seen booster bundles before, so I have my stack of 36 packs here. And I'm really excited to be opening this. So this set came out earlier this year. And I have to say, I wasn't the luckiest of people. I only got two SIRs or two or three SIRs and they were both trainers. So I definitely was not chasing those. Hopefully we can get really lucky today. Ooh, already lucky. Baby shiny. This is so cute. Oh, you know we good? The Raichu shiny as well. That'd be awesome. But I'm happy with this guy. Look at him. I think I've said this in the past, but I would love to make a shiny master set. But that's just... I don't think that's possible. <laughs> Unless you have one, then that's amazing. But yeah, I've opened I opened all of the Paldane products except for the booster bundles. So I was just hoping for some luck. They were on sale. So I thought it'd be a perfect time to revisit this. Nimona trainer. So I did get this SIR. Um I do not want it again. So the main chases really haven't changed much. It's still Charizard, it's still Bubble Mew. For me personally, I would have to say Pikachu and Bubble Mew, definitely. Oh my gosh, I forgot the Paldane students are in this. Oh, can we please not get a plague of Paldane students? So far, so good. Um, I don't think we're going to be avoiding these guys because they well and truly overprinted those guys in this set. Every time I watched an opening, Paldane students were there. Yes, we don't want you. Clive! Oh, what a start! What a start! This looks amazing! Not a voir. We have the SIR. <laughs> I forgot to mention this one. But it, now that I see it, yes. Wow, I love... You know the SIR is coming when you see this SIR border pattern. Oh my gosh. The bundles are delivering. Oh, Mimikyu. Mimikyu. I wonder if that was my good luck charm. Thank you, Mimikyu. Yes, fire pools. All right. Um, I should probably mention to you guys that I'm opening nice i'm opening some of my favorite sets again because i want to do a big grading submission i would definitely be grading with psa because hopefully they're a little bit more lenient not that they are with pokemon or anyone is but um yeah i would love to do a big grading submission to see what we can get so i definitely need some nice nice cards Pulling it is only half the battle. Oh, Moonlit Hill. I remember this card. I need that in a painting. I think that's a good start, guys. Everyone loves Gardevoir, so I'm really happy with that. Booster bundles are wild that I've heard because I haven't opened it, but the, you can get anything, everything, so I'm hoping... <gasps> Yay! Oh, it's so little. That's so cool. We've got the duo Baby Shiny. That's really cute. Um, if, I think if I had to pick the Pikachu as my Baby Shiny, number one. Charmander, of course. Snorlax is cute. Any Gen 1 Pokemon, any Gen 1 Pokemon I'd be so happy with. Magma, Raichu. We have Judge to go with our Nimona. Okay, we have another trainer. Let me know in the comments, guys. Were you lucky with the booster bundles? 
Because I've heard people got everything and some people actually got destroyed with that, so... Um... I'm actually really liking them at the moment. <laughs> Maybe that was my problem, I was opening the wrong products. Pineco. Ceruliage. This card I really liked always. It just... I don't know. Pokemon in the moonlight. So good. Pikachu in the Pikachu pack. Let's go. Let's go. I wish holiday sets came out with a full booster box. That would actually be really nice. But I guess this is the closest thing we have. Okay. <laughs> We've got the capsicums, I think. <laughs> and Clubopus. I don't want to jinx myself and say what we haven't been getting because I don't want to get that card anymore. So, Gengar, always a good card. For me, illustration rare. This card was everywhere as well. Mimikyu. And Palafin as well. So, at the moment, I'm not the, really the biggest fan of what's out. So, Twilight Masquerade. The Greninja isn't really my favorite Pokemon, even though I know he's like beloved by a lot of people. I just don't find the artwork for the SIR to be too appealing to me, personally. I do like the colors though, it looks like a big splash of colors, but um, I was debating whether to open it or not and I decided not to. I think only because there was only really two cards for me that I really wanted, obviously the Eevee and the Carmine. And personally for me, if there's only like a couple of cards that I want, um, I'm probably not going to open the set. Pikachu, we've got Great Tusk. So yeah, it wasn't really worth it for me. I think if you love a card, you should buy it. If you like a card, if you like a few cards, then you should chase the set. But personally, yeah. I only like the two cards, so maybe not worth opening any for me. That goes the same for Shrouded Fable as well. I love the Kingdra. Um, I think it's a promo. It's going to come out in English. Oh, Flamingo, Baby Shiny. Um, it's going to come out in English as the promo, which is cool. I definitely will hope to get that grade and hopefully find a 10 somewhere. But there's definitely Kingdra looks good. For some reason, I love the be the Beware illustration rare. I just love how it's like a really, it's a bit dark for Pokemon. I kind of like that. So that card was nice as well. Persian illustration rare. And there's, oh, Squawkabilly EX. There's also uh, the Horsey and the Kingdra full art. I guess, there's a, I guess you could say there's a few cards there that I do like, but I don't know. It's, it, for me, it's not really worth chasing a set for those. I mean, I say that, but you know what? Um, I'm very influenced, so I could open maybe one just to see. But yeah, that's kind of why I'm, go I'm going a bit backwards with my set. No, I knew it was going to happen. <laughs> Paldane students. It's not even the good one, apparently. We'll sleeve it, I suppose. We'll count how many we get at the end. So yeah, with Pokemon, I'm only going to open stuff that I really like. Some cute cards that I really want. This was definitely one of them, but I just wasn't getting any good hits. So I decided to stop. But considering there was a sale on... I think that was a good sign. Okay. Mastiff, Lantern, Moonlit Hill, Dawn Fan, Little, our Little Shiny. The board's getting filled up. Very quick now. These bits are insane. Who knew bundles? All right, starting with Cobblepuss again. <laughs> Whimsy Cop, Scrappy, Cobblepuss again. Jeez. 
That was like one of the worst packs, I think. Too many doubles. Okay, let's go. Mastiff, Ralts, Magma, Charmeleon would be nice in a shiny card, but no, we got this guy instead. <laughs> How do you see? What do you see? Do you reckon it sees like eight? <laughs> if that makes sense. I don't know. I think I was tempted to open Temporal Forces, but I don't know. The Pokemon again. Raging Bolt. I mean, it looks cool. The colors are nice. You know what? Illustration rares look nice. Like, SIRs look good. Even if you don't like the Pokemon, for whatever reason, they just always look so well done. So, like, I think for me, it just comes down to the Pokemon because the illustrations themselves are not bad. They look good. Um, of course, I wanted the ghastly illustration rare, but um, just that's just one card because when I opened it, I pulled Metagross. Espathra EX. They shouldn't have put this border because that is such a lie. Look, I'll show you. Gardevoir. It's the same border. They just do people like that. Thinking you pulled something amazing and it's this guy. Like, <laughs> I'm so glad that they stopped doing that. Well, at least so far that I've seen because it threw me off every time. Yeah, I think my happiest pull from Temporal Forces was Metagross because he was really cute. But yeah, that was it. Palafin. This card's very dark. So apart from that, I guess I'll just wait for the English version of Shroud Bay would come out. What's it called again? I can't remember right now, but Claude Sire. I'll just wait and then I'll see how I feel about it. If I open some. I will be, however, opening a case of booster bundles from Pokemon 151. Um, really soon, actually, because like I said, I want to grade some cards, see how we go. Um, so expect that video sooner than later. Glone. Ah, oh, Cyclops are. He's so cute. Yeah, expect that video because I'm really excited about that. 151 is my favorite set. My favorite set. I need to stop liking holiday sets, but I need to stop making them so good. I don't know. <laughs> Iono, we've got Clive, Curlia, Aldane Woofer, Toad School X. Surely there's more, this can't be it. Mimikyu, please, please give me Pikachu Shiny, baby, please. Hopefully that helped. It'd be funny if it did. Okay, Pikachu, Woobat, Moonlit Hill, okay, Katinkatong, Shaw, Shaw thing. I just love the layout of these shiny cards. I can't get over them. Even they're not, even if they're not my favorite Pokemon, I just love the idea of it. If these are still getting printed, Maybe one day I can put together a binder with just the shinies. That'd be cool. Oh, they in Charizard EX. With that border, that deceiving border. Look at that shine. We want the actual Charizard. The Charizard from this set looks nice, but I know that's like.
pack didn't want to open. Charizard looks nice. I don't know, there's better Charizards. Like, I prefer the Charizard from 151. You know? Completely different beast there, but I had to pick. Mousehold. Fido. Gengar. Professor's Research. I'm struggling with these packs a little bit. I don't know, maybe if Haldane plastic is thicker. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe it's just been a while. It has been a while since I've opened Haldane face, so maybe that's why. <laughs> that was brutal. Okay. Charmander, come on, there has to be another hit in here, please. There's something there. There's something there. All right, we had this guy. <laughs> Not really what I wanted, but gotta collect the shiny cards. Reaching the ends now, there's not a lot of packs left. Is it greedy to have more than one SIR? <laughs> Hopefully not. Oh, absolutely nothing. This was supposed to be my redemption round. It's supposed to be my comeback for Paldane Fates. You know how sometimes you're just lucky with a set and you don't understand why people don't get any pulls that are unlucky? Like for me that's Paradox Rift, but this one I just saw people pulling SIRs after SIRs, lots of bubble muse everywhere. I think Pokemon have pulled like two or three. I don't know. I don't know, maybe it's just this is just that set for me. Mastiff, the chunk, Mousehold, Iono, and the Mona. Damn. Haunter, Mime Junior, Hillwatchrel. I like this one, Horus. The anger in his eyes. That's why. <laughs> Absolute rage. <laughs> Got two packs left. It's really gonna come down to the last two packs. Oh, I don't know. Am I being greedy? Let me know if you guys have opened a similar amount and pulled way more things. Love to know. Gardevoir EX. Oh, at least. At least we have the full art. Last pack. And threatening Mimikyu did not help. Alright. It's gonna be a while if I open this set again, so let's slow roll this a bit slower. Five. Prime Ape. Fido. Gengar. Annihilate. Oh, try and try. Okay, guys, I'll show you the hits. Let's start with the EXs. With the Deceiving Border. Wish we had Charizard. I'm just gonna fly through these. There are quite a amount of cards to go through. Then we'll do our shinies. Two, three, four. So we're at ten. Ten shinies. That's pretty okay. These guys, trainers, illustration res. Surprise, I only had two. And just because, God of our full art, God of our illustration, special illustration rare. It's a really pretty card. It's beautiful. Alright guys, those are my hits. Let me know what you think. Otherwise, thanks so much for watching. If you're new to the channel and you enjoy Pokemon card opening content, make sure you like, subscribe, have the notification bell on, and you won't miss anything. Otherwise, happy hunting.